Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another brand new stream of Russian Fishing 4. Hope you guys are doing fine here. Uh, we are going after East Siberians first at the beginning of the stream here. Uh, before we go anywhere else. Uh, <clears throat> I want to go Archipelago after this because I'm desperate for money guys. I'm seriously broke. I spent hundreds of silver today making tutti frutti combos and buying a sturgeon stuff and pv look at this i only have 549 bucks left so uh if i keep spending i'm not even gonna get have enough money to uh go to arc and rent so oh my god what is going on here give me a second guys Hello Dijon, hello Romario, welcome guys, how's it going? Good to see you. Let's see here, East Siberian. Eleven, eleven. What's the date today? Eleven. 63, 64 kg came out today. Look at this. Oh, everything is 63, 67. And guess what I got today, guys? 61.752. Literally like an hour before the start of the stream here. Um, I did break my hook slash... Yeah, I did break my hook uh, on another Sturge, but then we got this guy right after. So I think we have a good chance today to get something decent on, uh, on stream. So. An arc should be good. Let's see here. The weather is good here. Arc is good. It's just raining every day and in three hours it's 7.2 meter per second. Absolute garbage, but we're gonna go anyway. Caleb, hi, how's it going? Big fishy. What is going on? Okay, full lock this bad boy here. Surprising amount of pull on this guy. I think he was just stuck against uh, the bottom. So. Uh, 10 KG Isa variant sturgeon to start the stream off. Very nice. Good start. Good start. Now we need a 10 times that size. <laughs> uh, the reason this spot is also very scary because 50 meter clip and then it's right by the boundary here. And I absolutely hate it that fish are allowed to go beyond this boundary, but not us. That is not fair. Yes, sir. <laughs> it is not. Okay. Ooh. -ooh. Please be a sterlet. And not a burbot. Only trophy burbots allowed <laughs> on the Shaffer larva and the PVA I'm using. Oh, that's an Amour. Okay, okay. 1.8, I'll take it. That's decent money. They pay well. How are you guys doing? Is everyone doing good? I hope uh, your weekend's... Off to a great start. 
All right, four minutes in. We have a burb, 10 kg serb, Siberian sturgeon, and then an amur. Very nice. Let's see what the rest of the day holds for us. Oh, look at that nightcrawler. Oh, no. Both, both rods had something on. Okay, something tiny. Mark, hey, how's it going? You are doing well. That's good. Good to hear. Thanks for tuning in. Oh my god, what the heck? Wow. It's so small, I should frame this in my house. We need like a double digit or a single digit fish that's usually large and just frame it on the wall. Okay, so something... Something bit this, but it did not uh, decide to take it, so... Doing all right, but it's different so from last night. Oh, man. Weeklies, all region. Uh, East Siberian sturgeon. Look at that. One, two trophies today. 120 and 114 kg yesterday. Three trophies. Uh, so, wow. Biggie. Hey. What's with the seas? Mark, uh, my Saturday night fishing fun. Hey, ah, oh, thank you, heart. Can I do that? Oh, that's on Discord. I have that heart cat. I don't have it on here. Dang. I see you. <laughs> hey, big, how's it going? So look, now I have four odd ultra series hooks on, okay? I don't know why I bought a 450 meter line at 74 kg. I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, you know what? This is 450 meters as well. I guess they don't come in 300 meters. Uh, he was rough. Some hard hitting went down. Noise. Yeah, only 74 kgs come in 450 and 1,000. Okay. Yeah, it made sense. After I looked at my second rod and it's also 450 meters, so I was like, you know what? Maybe there's a reason. <laughs> uh, but it is scary because you only have 187 meters of line, but I think to that shore is what? 100 meters? 80 meters? Something like that? So you should be fine. I was fine. Danny, hey, how's it going? Welcome. Big, anything interesting with you? Any interesting fish? Any trophies? I'm doing good as well, Danny. Thanks for asking. It's like 140, 150 meters. I know I had like very little line on. Uh, less than a quarter spool on. So... Sitting on belugas, 13 hours a day, hooking nothing. Damn. That's serious dedication. I am fishing for East Siberian sturgeons. These buggers here. So, uh... On my first one, I have 10 out of 10 quality East... Sturge PV on the second one. I have 9 out of 10 quality on, on third one. It's only a 39 kg setup, so I only have Nightcrawler on it. So let's see how it goes. I don't know. I feel like I might have killed the spot after I got 61 kg, 15 kg, and a few more. Yeah, again, like I was, uh, I was fishing for Sturge when he was on. And I think he was the one who told me the sturge spot is active and then I went fishing. And then uh, after a while, I just saw fish got away. And I'm like, oh man, he's been fighting it for like a good hour. I saw the screenshots on Discord. Uh, he said that I think he put his rod down to dig with the shovel and just instantly FGA. 
uh e siberian is good silver yes so the 61 kg i'm gonna release a video after the stream took me 40 minutes on uh the brand new venture i have and it was 289 silver something like that but the thing is though like it's not something you can uh consistently catch in one hour in one hour you might make 180 silver you might make 566 silver in one hour. You might make anywhere in that amount. So, Jovin, hi, how's it going? Uh, you made a grasshopper fly. Well done. Uh, sometimes, however, the sterlets are very active along with the sturge. So you can make some really good money in one hour. Uh, I did catch a 1kg sterlet here, but uh, I think they are just very rare right now. Let's check the sterlets. It's not e Siberian sterlet, it's Siberian sterlet. So, okay. 1 and 9kg was on the Shaffer. Wow, this guy's on fire. Look at this guy, Marco. Not only did he get a 9kg sterlet, but he also got a trophy sturgeon. What? This guy's insane. Marco Polo. Where is it? East Siberian. No, that's just Leo. Oh. Okay. Never mind. They both have the same... Uh, same whatever you call this display pick. East Siberian. All right, let's go. So originally I was not gonna stream here cause obviously it's slow fishing, but wow. When I tried it in the morning today, it was pretty darn good. So hopefully for the stream, we can either catch a few or catch at least one decent sized one. Still trying here. Hey Beluga, how's it going, Mr. Rare Carp Catcher? Sasa, welcome, welcome. It is going good, sir. So still trying for triple digit fish here in this game. I'm just not trying hard enough. About to get lost in Fisher Online. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, our, our biggest fish still is the 84 kg. Um, Beluga. When we were catfishing on stream, so. Mascudas yesterday got a trophy catfish and he accidentally released it. Uh, but he did say that in two hours of fishing, he only got one catfish. Uh, which is why I'm not going to try catfishing. I really wanted to for the stream. But, uh, I'm not going to do it. You had a good bite rate. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe it is worth checking out. But today is a full schedule. So I don't want to deviate from that. Uh, if these sturge don't work, oh god, ooh, that was a strong bite. Uh, if the Sturgy boys don't work for us, I'm just going to go straight to Ark. I'm going to troll for two or maybe even three hours. Ooh. Okay, this is strong. I don't think I can lock this guy. Thank you, thank you. Honestly, I am I don't even want to bother locking it cuz I've already shattered my hook earlier today. <laughs> okay, we got a big one. All I'm going to do is just walk to the right cuz uh, <clears throat> when I caught my 61 kg Sturge, once he was close to dying out, he actually went to the right of the boundary there. And I was so scared. 
Uh, but luckily, we easily full locked and brought him in. Actually, even with 29. Yeah, I don't know. He's not really running that hard. But I'm kind of scared. Oh, big got a bite. Maybe he's not that big. But he is very erratic. So we're not going to give him a chance. Ooh. Oh man, that's, ooh, that's so scary. This guy's nuts. He's going to the right, but I don't care. I'm not reading the comments. I saw. I'm sorry. Okay, he's not big at all. I was freaking out for no reason. Ooh. Once he's on the surface, we should be good. Twenty kg. Thirty kg, I'll take thirty kg. There you go. It's out of the water. I just need to make sure he's on land before I put the rod down. Yeah, he's right by the tree. Oh, he's tiny. Twenty seven kg. Okay, okay, I'll take it. Noise, noise. Good money, good money. <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't have raised my rod. All that does is reduce the energy. That was my mistake. All right, good start. Yeah, initially, uh, he really scared me. The way it was running. Wait, we have fish on already? Ooh, okay. Oh, no, it's a burbot or something. No. Oh my god, this is... Something tiny. I think it's stuck, yeah. It happened with that other fish too.
No, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna move here. Maybe we can get it out of the hole. Should I let go of the resistance then? And have it try to... There we go, we got it. <laughs> what a waste of my PBA. Oh man, that's 10 out of 10 quality too. So, this 17 meter hole, it was stuck at the corner of it. So that's like a wall. It goes from 17 meters to like 5 meters. And then 4 or something. So fish sometimes get stuck here. Uh, I've never had it stuck like this before. It's always been uh, where the resistance goes up because I'm dragging the fish's face against the wall. And then all of a sudden the resistance goes down and we're good. But this is first. <laughs> yeah, for a moment I was like, huh. I haven't had the wall do that to me. It's this intense, but... How many teas I do I have? 500 teas and 27 coffees. Ooh, big is that arc? It is nice weather. It's a little windy, but... Man. Who's going to be next? Something on the night crawler. <laughs> Burb. Oh my god, not even a marker. I'm going to chop.
Wait, what? Both Sturge and Sacton on Shaffer, which both Sturge? What are the Sturgeons who are active on Shaffer? Mole Cricket. Russian. Ooh, 13 kg. Uh, I've reached 100% harvesting, and now my ground bale lure making is at 80%. Nice. You're grinding those gears. Give me a trophy or more. <laughs> or burb. See that? That's it hitting the wall. The resistance goes up. And now we have cleared the wall and the resistance has gone down and we're retrieving it faster. Big burb. 4.3. So 27 minutes, we have 2 Sturge, 10 kg, and 27 kg. Not bad. I also wanted to float fish from the pier for broad whitefish and stuff. But I don't know if we're gonna have time for that. These sturge are kinda keeping us busy here. And I really need money. Oh yeah, guys, guys, the reason I'm so broke, the reason I have 500 bucks, even though I was at a thousand recently, is I bought this stupid thing. Where is it? This whole setup. There we go, jerk setup. I bought this specifically to catch a trophy pike at Tunguska. Did not catch any. Got 11.3 or 10.3 kg pike. That's my biggest one. And besides that, it's been absolute trash. Uh, I logged in about, what, three days in a row and tried to catch that stupid trophy pike. I did not get it. Uh, Mescuitas, on the other hand, it comes in. Within 15 minutes, gets a trophy. Next day, next day, he comes in. Within like 10 minutes, he gets another pike trophy. Uh, so this setup costed me 10 grand. I was so close. So close, guys. So close to my third TR rod. But I instead, I wanted that trophy so bad I bought this. And now it's just nothing. So I think this Regal 20 locks to 88 kg. I remember looking at the mega sheet, I just don't remember the number. So this thing can lock up to 88 kg, but obviously our rod is only 30 kg. So I cannot even do anything with this rod, like with the setup. Cannot go after catfish or anything. So until I get a better rod, uh, this will only be a pike setup. I don't know if it's 70 kg or 88 kg, I really don't remember. But yeah, this is just for pikes and nothing else. Let's see, we can do lure rig jigging. Uh, there are two ratios, but I don't know how to use these ratios. I don't know how to switch between the two. That would be cool. I really want to like switch it out and see how fast or uh, slow the reeling in is. Cool. 
control space. Interesting. If I remember today and I don't have three rods out, I'm going to try it. Slot, hi, how's it going? Welcome. It's not that great because it's 381. Great. I don't know these gear ratios. So I don't know which what number should be good and bad, but good for pikes. Yeah. Pikey boy. So the biggest pike was uh, still at arc, which is so sad. 11.55 kg is the biggest pike I have. And obviously the two that cut my line off. Hey, we got something here. Oh, maybe we don't. That's a night crawler anyway. Tiny. No. Stop getting stuck on that hole. There we go. <laughs> Poor fish. We were just squishing it, squishing it against the wall. <laughs> One point two six. I'm sorry. Sorry. Well, if there's ever another crazy pike spot that everyone's catching trophies at, at least I can go there. But the thing is, I only have this one lure. Uh, jerk fat, I don't have these handmade lures. This is the only one I have. Thank you so much, Epicolus, I asked. I asked in the chat and he gave me. And he's like, hey, there's a spotted amber too. Do you want a lure for that too? And I'm like, no, I don't. Because I'm not going to go to Amber and there's no reason for me to ask for that one too. So hopefully if there is ever a, an active spot. I know at Ladoga Lake, sometimes the active spot comes. Hopefully that's the lure that catches it. Uh, besides that, maybe at Ark we will get our trophy. I don't know. This chair is so squeaky now, I really need to oil it and I keep forgetting. I'm still stuck at 48 trophies, guys. We need... We need two more. <laughs> Did I catch anything? Uh, so far we have 10 and 27 kg East Siberian Sturge. Hopefully the next few minutes we hook onto a big one. I'm running low on night crawlers too. I think I need to start digging them again. Uh, harvesting baits, harvesting night crawler. Where is that? Or do we buy that from the shop? I don't know. Making weak. Okay, I'm in the wrong one. Wait, no, I'm not. That is the one. Harvesting. Night crawlers. Okay, so that is through digging. Ah, uh, Joe, when you're trolling Tunguska. Hey, I trolled Tunguska last night, guys, on the spikers, and I made 350 silver in one hour, which is decent. Uh, initially, I thought it was going to be absolute garbage because I was catching like so many non marker fish, but in the end, I was pleasantly surprised, made 350 silver. And I was happy with that. But unfortunately, at this point, I don't know if 350 silver is good enough for me. I need more. Because uh, we're just so broke. You made 800 silver in one hour? How? With spikers? Damn. Spikers. It's better than arc. 
Who knows? Maybe we will just give up and uh, not even go to Ark. <laughs> we'll just troll here. Uh, cause you know, at Ark we gotta spend 200 silver on the boat rental and then 30 silver Dodger works. I don't know which Dodger. Dodger crank 10 SS 007. Are these the ones? 007 And then what spot are you at? 13 meter hole Let's check. Atlantic Salmons. It's these ones that are working right now by the looks of it. What about other region? Wow, today 828kg came out on the 110F. I don't know where Big is fishing either. 13 meter hole. Damn it, no! What is with this garbage? Not on my PVA and uh, and Shaffer larva. That's so annoying. Great bite rate. It's so small, even by opening the reel, if it gets away, I really don't care. It's still a loss for me. But yeah, on a, on a big fish, I'd never do that. Oh, okay, I'll take that. 5.8 kg Siberian. Big, what, uh, what map coordinates? Sorry, not map coordinates. What map? Like, what spot are you on at Ark? And the other thing is, which blue dodger? Is it this one, 007? Is that what you're using? People said 13 meter hole is really good, then someone said F7 and H7 are really good. So I don't know what spot I should trust and go to. I really don't. I just want Atlantic Salmons, I love those. They're such good money. Hold up. No. I can't hold up. That ain't no Luga. That's a Stellet Sturgeon. 16 kg. Yeah, Dodger works. Hey, I mean, if it's working for you right now, I'm willing to give it a try. Uh, so what we can do is on the Super Doodoo, -doo, we can take this guy off. 110. But I, I still need you to tell me if I have the right Dodger you're talking about. Dodger Crank 10. Uh, this is... This is not handmade, so I don't need to worry about quality here. I hope these are the ones you're talking about. Ying Yang Slang.
Come on, sturdy boys. Stop being so camera shy. It's gonna be evening soon, and hopefully the burbots don't attack all three rods. I just don't need that. And then, I don't know guys, maybe in the morning we will leave for Ark? Is not sure. Uh oh. No. <laughs> Why? What garbage is this? This hole is being really annoying today. I've never had it give me this much of a hard time. Uh, 1.7 kg sterlet. Forty five minutes. Give me something here. <laughs> Hello, Drift. How's it going? You got a 19 for 98 kg linear albino carp. Mm -hmm. Very nice. <laughs> Was that joking? You should have waited on the JK though. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, now you go common albino. <laughs> Wait, you actually did catch a 19.888 kg common albino? Uh, linears are 25 kg. Mirrors and linears are 25 kg. And then leathers and grass are 28 kg, if I remember correctly. Grass, uh, black carp. Big heads, leather, are all 28, if I remember. Uh, today, 124.66. You know, my original plan was to do a little bit of float fishing at Tunguska and then go to Amber. Like, I made so many tutti fruity PBAs. Like, I spent, you know, hundreds of silver. But then, holy moly, uh, the stretch spot was so good, I just had to come here. And now that I'm even more broke, I decided to go to Archipelago. Because I really need money. And then tomorrow, we will go to Amber. Only carp trophy, that is 28 kgs grass. Really? Everything else? Uh, what about big heads? Uh, Jose? Jose? Hello, how's it going? Welcome. Big heads at 30. Ah, big heads are even bigger. Big head and silver carps, I guess, are 30. Grass is 28. Leather, everything else is 25. And then the commons are 20. I know, right? With this many hours, I still don't know the trophy sizes. It is going good. How about you? Come on, what is this? A grass carp playing with its food? Uh, leather's 30. Holy moly, this thing's on fire. It's trying, but maybe it's small enough. The way they run initially is so scary. Come on, you bugger. We're going to take a little nature walk. Oh god, ooh, I was not looking. Very angry. My forehead is so itchy, but I can't even scratch it. Because I'm so busy. Just going on a nature walk. Getting stuck on every single thing possible. Oh my god, this thing. Where are we? Where is this guy? Where is this thing? The Sturge is seriously trying, but... Okay, I will check who subscribed. <laughs> Welcome to the family, thank you so much for subscribing. Hey, it's already at the shore, nice. Let's bring it up here. Okay. No...
I wasted so many teas, it's stupid. Twenty nine KDE Siberian. That's how powerful the Venja is. Just full lock that puppy. Uh, Drift Sam, Drift ASM. Thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the family. What is this? Is this the second rod? Hold on. I don't know what rod this is. This is number two. Okay. I am bad at knowing the size of the trophies because I rarely ever catch them. Okay, so that's my excuse. What happened? Why can't I put it not down? The other rod is too close. Since when? Uh, let's see here. Bad two hours at Amber, only 350 silver. I'm fighting the fish like a cat because I can. YouTube is turned off my subscription. That's why I subscribe now. Ah, well, thank you so much. Hey, look. Humpback whitefish on a night crawler. Uh, okay. Imagine if that was a trophy. That would be sweet teriyaki sauce. Look at that. One hour. We have 29 kg Siberian, 27 kg Siberian, 10 kg Siberian, 1.7 kg Sterlet. Um, impressive. I'm very happy. Oh, thank you so much, Drift ASM. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Your kind words. Russian stir. 39. 11 kg. 40, 50. Yes, I love it. I heard that the other fish was fighting like a catfish. Oh, the fish was fighting like a cat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think initially what happened was it got stuck in the 17 meter. So I started like running this way and then I had to stop and just stand there. Gregory, hey, what's up? Yeah, 15 feet. What? 15 kg catfish in real life? Hi, damn. <laughs> 15 kg catfish in real life wow you're gonna sturge tomorrow <gasps> wow where are you are you in Lithuania that is insane. I wish you all the best. I hope you get some big fights if that's what you're going for. <laughs> that is just amazing. I wish I could say that. Hey guys, I'm going sturge fishing tomorrow. Or, you know, I got a big fat catfish. All right, we're going to go 13 meter spot because... That's big and big is the second person to say a 13 meter spot is doing good. You have a 23 kg carp. I'm going carp fishing for the very first time probably next weekend. Like I've never bottom fished in my life before until recently and I've never fished for carp before in my life. Uh, so uh, I was suggested use hair rig and use corn. And I don't even know how to do a hair rig. So I bought from Amazon hair rig hook and line setup. But then I need to learn how to put corn on it. I need to learn how, like, where to even put the weight. So I got to, you know, Google it and watch videos on how to do that. And I need to, and I need to uh, buy the tools. 
Uh, but yeah, it's... By the way, doing your own leaders. Well, yeah, you're a pro, I can tell. I am still a noob, so... I'm gonna buy the hair rigs first, and once I figure them out, that's when I will start trying to make my own. Hello, maybe your balsa. <laughs> and wobblers, wow. Who is he asking? I'm right now, it is not good. What PV are you on? Is there Easter Egg, Crab and Muscle Caviar? Uh, which, what am I using here? Zebra Muscle Caviar. Use the flavor tutti frutti and throw it in at the other shore. Wait, what? Wow. Print screen. Uh, Discord, I will uh, put it on MDoc channel. Ooh, mask. There we go. So on the MDOG in general chat, I have uh, posted. What I got it on. Uh-oh. Here we go again. This ones are worn out, Venture. So I kind of don't like it when we get a sturge on this. I want it on the brand new one. But it's okay. Venja is Venja, right? It's better than Tagara, so... <laughs> Now, it's a very good possibility that it's a burbit, and I'm gonna get pissed. It is a burb. Oi, oi, oi. You know, like, if you're, give, if you're gonna give me a burbit, or, or an amour, I'm using chaffer larva and PVA, that's so expensive. So, like, at least give me, like, almost trophy size to trophy size. You know, is is that too much to ask? Yes, yes it is. Humpback whitefish, 895 gram. Humpback whitefish. What a weird looking fish, but it is a very like expensive fish. 1.74 is my biggest one, really? I wonder what the trophy size is. Let's see. Weekly other region. A humpback whitefish. Oh my god, what? 4.5? I'm guessing 3 kg is a trophy size on them? I thought I was, oh, I thought like 1 kg was a trophy size. Damn. Nightcrawler. Where? Where did they fish for this guy? Or this guy just absolute RNG? Amours are... Nice and expensive fish, but when the amours are 900 grams, uh, they're worth less. Like 1.26 is okay, 1.8 is good. Alright, I don't know what to do guys. Should we fish for another, you know, half hour to an hour for the sturge? Because they are slowly coming in. Or should I go arc? Because we have loads of time. Look at this. In one hour, it's so good. 
I mean, it's it's good, not so good. 30 kg, 27, 10, 5. Like, it's not bad. I just don't know when the spot is spent. Stay. Okay, that's one for stay. I can do a poll for the people who are too shy to say anything. Should I stay or go arc in the morning? Uh, no, wait, hold on. Should I go arc in the morning? Can you show my carp in live? What? Uh, you're gonna have to message me. In game. Wow. That is a mirror carp. <laughs> oh my god, that is insane. That is insane. That is a huge... Uh, I cannot show my desktop. I can only show in-game. So, uh, that's the only thing. Man, why is this happening today? I don't get it. Or maybe it is a big one. Uh-oh. Our revenge is getting something. So we need to get this guy quick. Okay, tiny Sturge doesn't matter. Imagine if that's like a Sterlet trophy. That would be awesome sauce, but... 11, 12 kg, very nice. Do we have anything on? Oh, uh, we're about to. On our Nightcrawler, but it's probably something worthless. Yeah, the rod's not even bent. Not this jazz again. Okay, Nightcrawler, what what goodies do you have? Ew. Oh, no, it's a... No, it's a burp. 1kg. I'm not talking about going to Ark right now. I'm talking about going in the morning. Alright, how are we doing here? <laughs> Everyone wants me to stay. Uh, okay. We will stay. I guess we will spend another hour here. Another full day. And then in the morning we will go arc for two hours and hope we can get a trophy there. And make this number from 48 to 49. Unless we end up hooking on to a trophy Siberian. Then it'll be like, you know, two hours here. But uh, very, very nice for one hour. We just made like, what, 500 silver in one hour? I don't I don't remember how much the 30 kg are. 120 silver? 100, 200, 300, 400? No, I'm not going to go and check. It's too much running. All right, I need to go AFK for like two minutes. I'm just really scared to leave it alone here. Leave the spot. I'm gonna go AFK two minutes. I'll be right back really quick.
Honeys, I'm home. <laughs> okay, I am back. Uh, you have Lithuanian a record of this carp. Can you add me to streamer role in your Discord? I'm not the one who made that, but uh, I I don't just give it to anyone. <laughs> Those streamers are, uh, like I've been streaming with them for a while. So I have them as streamers. It's not even me who did that, actually. Where are we here? Uh, Gustav is a streamer. Uh, Bavi is a streamer, and that's all I've added. I haven't added anyone else to streaming role. So even though there are other people who stream who are part of my channel, I don't have them as streamers. Because the issue is then like everyone will be like, hey, can you add me to the streamer role? And then it'll be just way too many. Uh, Dodger Crank 007, <laughs> 29 KG line, Barracuda, so I have two Balsa Minnows 110F, if they are getting a slow bite rate and we notice that the Dodger Crank is getting a really good bite, then we'll put all of them as Dodger Crank. Hopefully morning brings in something here. <laughs> oh no, fish got away. We might have something on. Still not hooked. Alright, thank you so much for being part of the stream. Enjoy the rest of your night. Drift. Bye. Can we like get a smaller bourbon than this? 200 grams, that's the second one I've caught.
Uh, size one hook. It's not even like I have a size like 20 hook. We have a 39 kg line. Perhaps I should have put a leader on this. 29 increase the size or the quality of the burbs. I can't wait to go to ARC. Oh my god, I want money so bad. And I love reeling in Atlantics. Such good money. They look such clean fish. Let me check the weather once more. So tomorrow is such trash weather. Heavy rain, 7 meters per second wind. The day after that, 6.4 meters per s- Oh my god, it is bad weather for the next four hours. No! Damn it, we should have gone ARC first. I might just do one hour of fishing at ARC because the weather is really bad. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Hmm. Volkov, I haven't gone to Volkov in I don't know how long, forever. Volkov is bad weather, it's too hot. And honestly, I don't even know if it's active, if you can even make good money there. I really don't know. But I feel 17, 18 degrees is too warm. yank on all the rods from time to time you know wake them up buzz 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 come on morning give me something good here Another 200 gram. The heck, man. Come on. Two hundred eighty-seven. Oh, it's like 87 grams bigger than the last one. Oh no, Ark just died. No, please don't say that. <laughs> no. I was gonna go to Ark tomorrow. Maybe we will end up just trolling tongue. 
Maybe we will go to art tomorrow then. It's always good to have options and I'm really happy that we do know of a few options we can do. Uh, what are the lure I could use for pikes and tunguska? I don't have jerkbait unlocked. Impulsive, hello, welcome to the stream. Uh, I don't think you can use anything else unless someone knows. Uh, I've never piked fish much, so I'm not an expert in the field. All I know is uh, there is a spot here at Tongue with a jerk bay. You can have a very good chance of getting a trophy. Um, besides that, honestly, you can... T I don't know what to tell you. There's not much of a chance. Like, you can use... I know back in the day... Hold on, let me reel this in. And then I'll show you the lure I used to use at Old Berg. Maybe that will work for you here. I don't know. 1.5, not bad. So back at Old Berg by the birch tree, this funky minnow used to be really hot from time to time. Uh, you could try that, but honestly, I'm not the right person to ask. I, I wouldn't know. One hour, 25 fish, 566 silver. <laughs> I hope, I hope you get it. Impulsive, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, damn. You got a 4.3 kg or more. Is that a trophy? That's not a trophy. Trolling is dead on tongue for now. I tried a few times this morning, not much. Oh, no. I know last night, uh, in real life, obviously, Friday night, uh, I was trolling here with spikers. And I made, uh, what, 360 or something silver in one hour? So I was thinking if Archipelago fails, if it's really bad weather like it is right now, uh, we could just troll tongue. Uh, but now I'm conflicted if it didn't work for you. Tongue's really bad. It's too windy. Maybe I might just go, uh... I might just go Amber then. Amber's really hot. Uh, with Tutti Frutti. So, I'm not sure what to do. We can play it safe and just go Amber, honestly. Uh, Amber, 67, 157, Pier 1, Tutti Frutti. You know what? Let's do that. I'm going to change the stream title here. Uh, we can do float fishing for a little bit and then we will go Amber. Why is my title so messed up? What was I doing? You know what? That's what we're going to do. All right, guys. So we're going to do this for one more afternoon. Okay, one more day. Uh, it's uh, 8, 17 a.m., you know, nighttime we're going to spend here. In the morning, we were going to go to the pier, and we're going to do float fishing for broad white fish and stuff. If you guys want to have a competition, we can do that. And then I'm going to go amber for maybe two hours, 
and we're going to try 2D Fruity Soluble and stuff and hopefully make a good bit of money there. So Archipelago is going to suck. It's heavy rain and winds. Not going to work. Yeah, it, there's no harm in trying, but... Sorry, not looking good in the forecast. And if the stirred spot is active tomorrow, then I might come here again tomorrow. Beginning of stream. Oi. No, please be something big. Damn it. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Is four odd hook too small or like what the heck? One point five could you sterlet? Okay, I'll take it. Sterlet's not bad. It has been a little slow though. We have two sterlets, one point seven, one point five seven. DT gaming, hey how's it going? What's up? What's up, what's up? Let's see here. Wait, what? Record catch bottom fishing tackle, 61 kg. Uh, I just got this before the stream. What the heck? What does this mean? Record catch bottom fishing. That's my biggest fish in bottom. And this beluga was on spin fishing. That is so funny. Huh. Okay. And the leather carve was most experience. Cool. I like the variety in the screen. Uh, you just got your Sterlet trophy on G413KG, I believe it was. What? Wow. Wait, G4. What's G4? A tongue? Well, congrats on that. That's pretty darn cool. Good. Uh, DT just woke up. Yeah. Going to be going on around two hours from now. Going after bear scarp. Yeah, bear. People are pulling trophies out the last two, three days, but the bite rate's really slow, so I did not bother going there. But bear is interesting. Low level people love bear. So... If you stream or make a video on it, I'm sure you're going to get good views. You want the black trophy. All the best. I hope you get it. Yeah. When I streamed there, uh, we ended up getting a black carp trophy. And once we hauled in the black carp trophy, our other rod was getting spooled. And there was a grass carp trophy on that rod, back to back. <laughs> that was so epic. That was just an insane stream. The... <laughs> Why 
what's going to suck is converting these bottom setups into amber setups. Where is amber? 26, 20, 28, and then it goes 17 and 19. What the heck is going on? Is this too hot for amber? I don't know. Yeah, PVA and boilies and pellets and all that stuff. Come on. Maybe evening time we'll get a bite. I'm going for sturgeons. If I can get sterlets, then sure, I'll welcome it. Uh, yeah, sturgeons are our main focus. Bycatch are sterlets, burbits, and amur cats.
Oh. Please be a big sturge. No, <laughs> it's a tiny fish. Why? I really don't want to move. There we go. Let's see how small this fish is. Ooh, Sturge. Yeah. Little baby Sturge. No. <laughs> we wasted that PBA. Let's see. Nine out of ten. Waiting for lunch, fixing to wake up my taste buds <laughs> with some heat, yes. Oh man, you woke up for lunch, wow. Okay, a baby Sturge, let's go. We got another fish. Oh boy. <laughs> Beluga, hey, what did you miss? Ah, uh, not much. Twenty nine, twenty seven kg sturge, twelve, ten kg sturge, starlets, all the sturge. I was able to full lock. That's about it. Nothing big. There we go. Yeah, it's stuck. Is that a sterlet? That's a darn sturge. Damn it. Give me a sterlet if it's small. Yeah, but I was just, uh... I know I've already said this, but uh, I got this guy in the morning, an hour before stream. Yeah, you should only open the bill for small fish, because there is a chance it will get away. 
So since it's small, I can do that. I was doing that before. But uh, I stopped, yeah. You're telefishing now. Okay, Joven. I would just run to the side and pull at a different angle. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I was just... I just did not want to move because putting the rod down is so annoying. So I was hoping I could just brute force it. <laughs> uh, but once that didn't work, I had to run to the side. Please give me at least one big stirs, like 20 kg, 30 kg, 40 kg. Before morning. Morning, we will go fly fishing. Sorry, no, uh, float fishing. Uh, from the pier, uh, I will be using the telly stick, using stone fly, size for hook. Hopefully, we get a trophy of some kind, you know, broad white fish or something. Uh, we will do that for a little bit and then we will go amber and make some money for a good hour there. So if you guys want to like float fish with me, you know, in a competition or something, uh, we can do that. If a lure is 65F and the other is 110F, which one is bigger? I don't know. Let's see here. They seem the same size. Oh no, this is 75F. Hold on. Where's the 100F? Yeah, bigger the number, bigger the lure should be because look at this. Balsa 75F003 is 10 grams, 7.5 centimeters. Uh, Balsa 110F is 14 gram, 11 centimeters. So 10 and 7.5, 14 and 11. 75F, 110F. So the bigger the number, the bigger the lure. Is that what you're asking? I'm sure you heard me say it on stream, but I typed anyway. <laughs> Yeah, you could check. For once, I was right and I was able to help, okay? <laughs> so what? Wasting time? Look, I'm standing here waiting for a fish. I'm just saying I'm happy I was able to help. Beluga also, I bought this stupid thing. Last weekend, 10,000 silver. That's why I'm so broke right now. Did not catch a single pike trophy on it. <laughs> Yeah, that's bought by the birch tree or there by the spawn. Uh, Mascutas came within 15 minutes, got a trophy. The next day, he came again and within like, what, 11 minutes or something, he got a trophy again. And here I was trying for like, what, six hours over three days? No trophy.
I don't even know how to pronounce your name. I just call you Beluga. But your first name means fisherman in Lithuanian or something. I remember you were saying. I just call you Zedvius Beluga. That's how I pronounce it. Zedvius. <laughs> Do we have fish on yet? Yeah, because your first name, so many people have it. So it's not like it's a name. It's like a word, you know, that gave gives you a hint that, hey. And I think you said it a long time ago. Maybe someone said it, that it, it means fisherman. So I remember. Come on, how can you like nibble on and then just leave? What is this? I think there might be a fish on. It's just not hooked yet. Zabies. Yeah? Zebby? Zebby yeast. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, Zebby yeast? Yes! Yeet! Yeet! Yeet, yeet! Yeah, I think the spot's either dead or it's just spent. Or maybe it's not. Who knows? Who knows? But uh, we're just going to spend the night here. And then morning, we're going to do some float fishing. <laughs> what are we doing here? 44 minutes, 8 fish, nothing interesting. 12 kg, 4 and 3 kg. Not good. First hour was really good. Second hour, not so much. This is how far I came. And that's as much as you can go. That's too bad. You should have been able to go all the way up to the rocks. Hundred and fifty one meters longest throw. Rookie number. I just saw some guy threw one point eight kilometers. And that has to be like abusing of a glitch or something. Because one point eight kilometers, like how do you is there even how do you even get that much line on a reel? That's insane. That is insane. I know you're talking about it a long time ago. You found a way to do a really far cast. But like how the heck? 
how do you even get that much line on on a spark okay see that's fake like that is that's fake you cannot fit 2.5 kilometers line on a spark so even though it's impressive you know it's fake how what line did you have on that had that the shop sells that's three kilometers no it's not scales okay go away 28 kg caspian brown nice Missed angry. <laughs> That's your first Caspian ever. That's bigger than the Caspian I have. Granted, we only fished for Caspians one time, and second time recently it was absolute trash. But, uh, 23. I had 40% friction break while it ran out of the map, so I had to lock it. With bent, that was my weak point. Interesting. No, I... I need a proper one. Where you have, you know, legit line on your spool and you somehow throw it with the heaviest weight with headwinds or backwinds, whatever, and you get it. What is the password to the rod? Is it broken? I don't know the password. I was invited into the group. Hey. It's only this rod that's getting everything, which is surprising because I have a 10 out of 10 quality PV on this one. Is this a Sturge? Is this a Sturge? I don't know. No, it's stuck, isn't it? No, it's not stuck. Or maybe it is? Thirteen kg. Tiny, tiny fishy. Where is this fish? I don't remember. Well, not that I don't remember. I just... What the heck? How did I bring it out this far? 15.8 kg. Okay, I'll take it. I like that. <laughs> uh, that's way too easy. Give me more, please. Twenty kg. Joan was close. Fifteen kg. I thought it was going to be thirteen kg. Yeet that fishy. Ah, <sighs> now it's night time. Now the burbots are gonna eat away at our PVA and stuff. All right, ZVS Beluga. Thank you so much for hanging out with us for a little bit. Have a great night. Hey, we have 20 likes. Thank you so much. For all the likes. If you haven't already subscribed, join the awesome family. Someone just got 110 kg catfish. Cat hole, fish hole. How are we doing here? One, oh my god, two hours already. Uh, last hour, guys, only eight fish. That's terrible. 
But we have 29, 27, 15, 11, 10 East Siberians. Kuba, hey, how's it going? Welcome. What's up? Did I drink tea just yet? Yes, I did. There we go. We're getting a burb here. Either a burb or an amour. Let's see. I'm running low on nightcrawlers. When I was neat to the game, someone gifted me like, I don't know, 5,000 nightcrawlers or something. And all these years, I've been using that. Oh, come on. Seriously? At least our bottom fishing went up, so I'm happy. Let's chop that guy up. Uh, float fishing, the village pond, you caught a very big roach. Nice work. And your friend got nothing. It is the village. It is the cottage pond. So. Uh, I wish I could do absolute records for cottage pond. But I can't. Albino. Catfish. Nightcrawler. Wow. Well. Eight hundred to nine twenty-five kg. Wow. Black Sea Belugaloos. Grass carpet Tunguska, what? That is extremely rare. I've never seen a grass carpet tongue. That should be like a water body record for that specific. Trophies, Tunguska, look at how sad this is. Tunguska, only a muxin, pellet. Peeled, pallid, and brownie. It's all the trophies I have. Even after trolling, after spending so much time in the small river, no grillings yet. Hey, we're getting something, we're getting something. Oh my God, yes. Yes. No, it's small. No. No. <laughs> No, that is not even a marker. They aren't even a Tunguska and you still got it. What the hell is this? On my 10 out of 10 quality. What? Get out of here. Seriously, 4 aught hook for this garbage? Ah. You're killing me. I don't know what kind of bite that is. That's just a fish that was swimming by and it's it just got too close to the hook and it got stuck. It ripped into the side of its belly. Mm. 
Wait, hold on. Tunguska. <laughs> yeah, the fish doesn't even exist in Tung. The grass. There is no grass carp here. There's Gibble, and that's it. I don't know. Maybe there is a grass carp in the pond here. I don't know. But it's not on the list, so... No, there isn't, Kuba. <laughs> That's just big being a big phony. <laughs> uh... All right, morning, we're going to go. F I keep saying fly fishing. We're going to go float fishing at Tongue. If anyone wants to join me on a competition or something, I don't know. I don't even know what fish we're going to get. All I know is we're going to catch broad white fish. Uh, what else can we get? I forgot the name of the fish we were catching last week. Broad white fish. Uh... Muxen pellet we were catching. Bye, Wuko. Hey, how's it going? Welcome. Welcome to the stream. I don't know what the heck we were catching. Because I want to ca uh, I want to do like a three fish competition, the biggest size. Uh, bra white fish, 100%. The others, I don't know what else we get. Mox. Moxilisk? Moxilix? Hello, welcome to the stream. How are you guys doing? Uh, clip 55 50 meters. <laughs> you are welcome, all the best. That is Mars over there at the top, the really white, bright star. Underneath it is uh, the Big Dipper. Uh, to the right, that real, that small, small star there at the bottom. I think that's Saturn. And uh, yeah, that's a little bit of a star grazing for you. Star grazing? What? Star gazing. Uh, there's Sterlitz. Wait, what? There's an active Sterlitz spot? At Tongue? I didn't know there was a Sterlitz spot at Tongue. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> G4, right. You said that, but G4 is the small river here. What are you talking about? Like, what's the clip? That's 60 meters. That's not going to work. I think it's G7 maybe you're talking about. Spot for Stillard is 4135. 4135 is right here. That's still a 17 meter hole. 12 meter hole. 12 meter hole is right here. 50 meters, okay. Uh, Shaffer larva on this guy as well. I'm not gonna go there, guys, because like morning time, we're gonna do float fishing. Uh, but maybe tomorrow if I want to, we could. 4135, this is 4135, that's so weird. You guys are talking about this hole though, 12 meter. Ooh. Oh man, something bit our line and that's why it's all the way over there now. I was really hoping for something big, you know? I wanted a long fight on stream. Like that 60 kg I had before <laughs> the stream. But not today, I guess. Who knows, maybe at Amber we will hook into a... A blue tag. And that'll be a long fight, maybe. I don't know. We shall see. Sterlitz. A Siberian Sterlet. Uh, one, two today, two yesterday. Okay, 10 and 11 kg, wow. At 2 a.m., we will move so that we can start fly fishing, fly fishing, uh, float fishing by, you know, 4 a.m. All right, what's this going to be? Is this going to be a sturge or is this going to be a burbot? This is our 10 out of 10 quality PVA. Or maybe it's going to be nothing. Really? Really? It's gonna be a non-marker garbage? I give up. <laughs> Screw this. Spot is spent. We will try again maybe tomorrow on stream. Because this is another sadness here. I'm gonna end your life just because you're too small. Burb. Bye-bye. There's another PVA lost. Ooh, good job, Biggie. Is Big at Bear or is he... He's at Amber. You're at Amber, right? Because I'm going to go to Pier 1. And do the Tutti Frutti combo. You know what? Let's do it right now. So we need... 
snowman rig we need 45 kg line 36 this that everything wait why is this worn out we need brand new everything Two D twenty, two D red, two D fruity, thirty five meter clip. No man. Uh, 39, short thing. Oh, damn, I forgot to change the hook. So we got to do that. Good thing we stopped now, because I got to sell the fishies. I got a run over there. Yikes, four odd hook. That's not gonna work. Let's put one odd and redo all this garbage. All right. 39, let's give you a slightly less worn out. <laughs> All right, we are ready for Amber, but before we go to Amber, we are going to do float fishing here. I need something. I need a trophy of some sort. But we are going to check out how much money we made in two hours. First hour, I bet you we made like four or five hundred silver. And second hour, we really did not make anything. We might have made a hundred silver, 150 silver. So that's going to drop our hourly average. But any money is good money for me right now. I can uh, no beggars can't be choosers right now. I wish Ark was still good, but just terrible weather. Are we going to have any cafe orders? I doubt it. Broad whitefish. Ruffian. Not this thing. All right, let's see here. Two hours, 578 silver. Of course, I knew it. 133 silver, that's 29 kg. 126 silver, 72 silver. Gucci. So if we look here, the first hour was absolutely amazing. Up till here, I would say. 400 silver. Second hour, 168 silver. So you can see it really slowed down second hour. I will take it, we finally are past the 1,000 silver mark. Gookie, gookie, gookie. All right, let's go ahead and equip our ethnic Bolognese. Oh no. How deep am I supposed to go here? I don't remember. Two meters, thank you, okay. If this sucks, I'm just gonna go Amber.
What about Yama? I haven't been to Yama in a very long time. Uh, I don't know when I'll go to Yama. 1.6 meters. Uh, check VK. VK is your best bet. That is a Russian site where people post spots and stuff. So that's the site I follow. Uh, when I want to know what spots active and what's not. Garbage. No, I don't have sandwich. My skill is only 52.1%. I hate float fishing. Uh, but last weekend at the spot, we were catching a lot of fish and there was a chance we were going to get a trophy. But I think this spot is still active this week, maybe. Muxen 1kg. Turley! Hey, how's it going? Welcome! What's up? Oh, there's a new post for this spot. From today? Okay, I'll check it out. I'll check it out right after I get this fish. Yeah, last week and it was really good. Ooh, is this round white? No, that's a broad white fish. Let me check here. Oh, it's no, no. Oh, wow. Right now, literally. That's sandwich, though. What is that? A Muxen trophy? Or a broad white fish? I want a broad white fish trophy because we already have a Muxen. I hate this. <laughs> oh man. We caught yours on a red worm, okay. Arctic Omol, very nice. I mean, give me a Sardine Cisco trophy or a Broadbot fish trophy or an Arctic Omel trophy. I'll take either of those or all of them all at once. Elid, okay. I like this. Look at how quickly we're getting these fish. Two minutes and we already have five markers. If it continues like this, it'll be really good. I wish I could just bottom fish for them here. I get so many skill points <laughs> all at once. I mean, one after the other is the closest we can get it for all at once. Unless we have like that line system where you can have like a chain of hooks. Oh wow, I was not even looking. Broad white fish, noise. I like the broad white fish, it looks so interesting. It looks like a purse, a golden purse, a Gucci purse.
Something's trying to pull it. I also hooked on to a Nelma. I think I got a small Nelma on float right after ending the stream last weekend. Yeah, that was a bit of a fight. Oh, poop. I struck too early. That's my fault. Thank you, Dijon, for the spot. The issue with Yama is, even if some spot's working for you, it's not going to work for me. So many times that happened. And then the issue is always the Paul Walkers are active there, and I don't have a setup that can cast those angry Paul Walker lures, so I just stopped the only time i'll be interested in going is if it's like the satori's that are active what the heck is going on that fish just spat out Muxin. Hold on, guys. Okay, I'm back. Okay. Give me a trophy. Dynamitist! Hello, how's it going? Welcome. What's up? We were just sturge fishing earlier. We just finished sturge fishing. Uh, first hour was great. We got a few sturge. Uh, second hour, very slow. We're going to do float fishing for a little bit before we go to amber and hopefully get some rare carps, but most importantly, make some good money because I really need money. Uh, we are broke. Damn it, come on. Mm. 
Mm. You're fishing at Amber. Uh, so I'm going to go to Pier 1 imports and use 20 soluble, 2D fruity, the whole shebang. And hopefully we can make some good money. I hope it's been going amazing for you at Amber. Float requires just too much concentration. I don't like it. So many people catching short headed barbels. It's crazy. There must be an active spot. There's this weekly records coming out for a long time now today. Uh, I have two rods that are TI, so I am using PVA, Tutti Frutti. So I'm happy we can at least <laughs> do that. Come on, garbage. Arctic Omel, very nice. That's the second shiny fish we have. Sardine. I have to give this spot some time. Can't just leave right away. If you guys want to have a quick like 12 in-game hour competition, we can do that. But we need at least like two people besides me for the comp. But then anyone with a sandwich mod is going to have a major up. So, I don't know. Oh, come on. That was underwater. What are you talking about? That time it didn't even go underwater. I still hooked onto a fishy.
1.6 meters is the depth I'm using. Maybe the trophies are at like 2 meter depth or 1.5 meter depth. One Muxin, <laughs> funny looking fish. Pellet. <laughs> Not bad, 13 markers, 14 minutes. Happy this is still active, but... Again. Ah. Oh, come on, that went underwater. Where hey, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Wow, 12.9 kg short headed barbel. There is definitely a barbel, short headed barbel hotspot, cause damn. So many short headed have been coming out. Burble.
I think we should go to Amber now. What do you guys think? One more fish. Come on, let's go. No, I don't think there's any cafe order, so... There is! 27 is silver for that single Omo. Nice. 27, 85, very nice. Let's go. Wamber. Uh, DT Gaming, thank you so much for hanging out with us. Enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs> One <hand> type. <laughs> thank you so much. Have a great rest of your Saturday. Bye. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, Pier 1 imports is where we're going. I hope it's good. Okay, we could have gotten even more closer. But it's okay. It is a bit windy. Wow, two posts from uh, from the same spot at Yama. 
Interesting. Hypnotic. Interesting. All right, so is Amber a bust? We will find out soon. Gonna wait for it to become evening and hopefully that starts the fishy bite because <laughs> this is concerning. It's extremely hot today and tomorrow so I'm guessing this is why Amber sucks maybe. Uh, which sucks big time because arc is really bad. Heavy rain today. Very windy. I do not want to go to bear because I'll need to make new PVA and oily and stuff. And that's just not happening. I should have just trolled uh, Tunguska. Honestly. <laughs> uh, but we should be getting something. Hopefully fairly soon it starts up. Hey. Okay, something decent. Common car by the looks of it. Twelve point four.
I haven't been to Pier 1 in a very long time. <laughs> okay, okay. Should I just put like corn on this and maybe we'll catch a lot of fish on this? What do you guys think? Come on, Amber, you can't be that bad. Please. Arc is trash. Amber is too hot. And we have nowhere else to go. <laughs> I can always go <laughs> I can go back to tongue and then troll. <laughs> And hope we make enough money to pay for our 100 silver. Pay for our 100 silver ticket back. Uh, Yama. Yeah, Yama is 19 degrees. That's bad weather. 20 degrees bad. I think up to 19 or 18. I think it's up to 19 degrees. Yama is good. 19 or under. So maybe we're just borderline right now. Is that a rare? Yes, that is. Yay, barbecue corn. 2.2. I need a double digit though. When it comes to rares. Size one hook, size one hook, size one ought. We ought to get a big fish.
Hmm, ber, 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 ber. I think tomorrow sh tomorrow should be fine. Twenty six. And I need more ghosties. Hey, our bottom fishing went up again. Yes. Yeah. That's a win. I am happy. So 0.2% our bottom skill has gone up today. What's with this rod? No one wants to bite this rod. Six KG mirror. Okay, okay. Six markers, eight minutes, twelve, six, five point five, and six KG. We have a small three and a two. Wow, that middle rod is getting nothing. That's a PB rod too. What the heck is going on? Hey, we might be getting something on the middle one.
It's upside down. Oh, damn it. That is a stupid comment. For a moment, I thought it was a ghost. Freshly pickled pickles. Yum. All right, 12 minutes, 10 markers, not bad. 12, 7, 7, 6, 6, 5, 4. Not bad. Second water body record this week. Okay. Ooh. Triple trouble. Never mind. This is a sad fish. Yuck. Okay. Very nice. Congratulations. Water body record. Five kg. <sighs> the Mets. Hello, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. What's up? What's up? Man, I'm waiting for these darn ghosts and albinos and starvis to come. Yes, I am fishing amber. Ex ex it was extremely slow because look at this, 28 degrees. Uh, but we are getting bites now, which is good. Let's see how it goes. I'm at Pier 1. Pier 1 imports. Uh, tutti Fruity 20 Soluble, Tutti Fruity Red Corn, and Dip. Snowman rig. Sinking plus corn. 35 meter clip. And PVA is obviously everything tutti fruity. Toots fruits. Yep, all rod same. It's nothing great, honestly. But like I said, it could be because of uh, the warm temperature.
Oh yeah. That is a trophy. Thanks for correcting me. <laughs> because the first and only trophy I got of the Russian Sturgeon was the 55 KT. And ever since then, I've believed that a trophy is 55 and not 50. <laughs> uh, I can never remember. I feel like I should just use corn on this one. Wow, he got it really easily. Like within two hours, he ended up catching a trophy. He has amazing RNG. Uh, like he was fishing for, I don't know, one hour or something. And he ended up <clears throat> hooking onto a trophy Siberian, which unfortunately he lost. And in another two hours, he ended up catching a Russian Sturgeon trophy. You can't check trophy size there. Wait, what? What are you talking to? Where? <laughs> 17 markers, 19 minutes. So far so good, just recently we started getting really small fish.
<clears throat> Mole cricket is what they're active on, so I can't go for Russians. <laughs> 83 dead it is night time so you you're not gonna expect much oh look at that that is a nice sized ghost barbecued corn oh why am i running 9.689 come on man give me a double digit already nice yeah i don't have rhino i only have 15 pieces of rhino and crayfish i don't have any i only have one What? Buh, buh, buh. So. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy with this one. Yes. Common ghost carp is a hybrid of koi and common carp. Unusually colored, these ghost carps are prized by many anglers. It is believed that they are smarter than their ordinary cousins and are harder to catch. Coolio. Ooh. How appropriate ghost coming out at night. Hit that like button. Yes, wait, we're one away from 30? Oh, we can do this. Yeah, hopefully morning it's, it'll be more, more action. <laughs> Thanks, it's, you don't have to, it's not, not that crazy important. What is important though is, uh, you know, if, if you get a chance or if you ever want to, you guys can check out my videos that I upload uh, Tuesday to Fridays. And if you do watch the entire video, which I hope you do, please just comment. Comment on it and like it and watch the whole video. Those three things help out a lot, especially if you watch the entire video and not just the first two minutes. Uh, it actually helps a lot. So, those of you who are doing that, thank you so much. You guys are awesome. Now, let's try to catch a trophy ghost carp. Or, el or an albino carp. Or a cheeto carp. Looking kind of grim, but... Doesn't hurt to try. No, cat. I don't know. I don't know. Like maybe tomorrow I might go to Octuba. We can go catfishing first and then we can go after the Sturge. Or maybe something like that I can try. Because I really need money. And cats are just too slow. For today though, this is my last stop. 
I'm not gonna go cats. That will take too long. Are they active in the big river or in the smaller ones? Ah, yes. Hello, welcome from the second amount. We have over 30 likes. Thank you so much for all the likes. You guys are awesome. Thank you. Yay, we hit 30. Eleven meter hole for catfish in the big river. Okay, that's good. That's good. I think that's in the big river, right? Uh, eight of these. How many molds do I have? Fifteen. Mole crickets. Yep, I saw it. <laughs> oh man, he gets a trophy and boom, just releases it. <laughs> yes, yeah, hurting so much out. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's funny. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. That's like an easy 1,000, I don't know, 300 silver trophy. And he just lost all that. Hey, it's a baby ghost. Oh my god, that is way too small. 3.4 kg mirror ghost, but look how many ghosts we're catching. Half hour, not even half hour, we already have three ghosties. Granted, two of them are tiny. <laughs> 49 kg mirror carp someone just got damn all right mirror ghost carp common ghost carp and second biggest fish is a another ghost carp well sasa just because you don't know how to fish doesn't mean i shouldn't go with the fortuna rod <laughs> oh man, I'm kidding. Uh, you do know I got a 55 kg trophy Russian sturgeon on the Fortuna, right? 39 kg rod and I had the 26.5 kg Tagara. This is what I caught my trophy Russian sturgeon on all that time ago. So you just got to be careful, honestly. Yeah. It was a 45 to 55 minute fight. It was very scary. Uh, but I just couldn't believe it. Someone gifted me, I think, three mole crickets. I went to the spot, I waited a bit, and on the second mole cricket, I got the trophy. And it was just insane. Wow, we have a fish on every rod right now, I think. Oh, that sucks. But you know what? It's it's all good. Hopefully you learn from your mistakes and don't do it again. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, I screwed up today. Uh, before starting the stream, I was fishing for East Siberian Sturgeons when I got the 61 kg. But right before I hooked the 61 kg, I was full locking the sturge and it was still running. And I was too slow and it snapped my hook. Luckily I didn't lose any line. Oh my god, is that is that another ghost? No, that's a stupid sun playing tricks on us. 6.6 .6 kg mirror.
So thankfully, you know, it didn't damage my setup. I got my eye on Rhino. Okay, so that's what I was gifted. Not Mole, Rhino. And that was a very long time ago. That was like a year and a half ago. I was I was brand new to Octuba. Like I just unlocked Octuba at that point. And I ended up catching a trophy. And I... And Big at the time only had Calibers. And he was fishing for Russian sturgeons with the Calibers. Oh, you had Tagara? I think you had one Tagara and maybe one Caliber? Seventy-five percent, you'll get there. It's not too bad. Where are we here? Since I got a fifty-five kg as my trophy, ever since that day. It's just stuck in my mind that a trophy Russian sturgeon is 55 kg, not 50. Uh, that's why I just keep forgetting. <laughs> uh, Romario, one of my rod is just corn with the pop-ups, double corn. And I'm getting tiny fish on that as well. So I'm using everything. How much silver? I have no idea. Um, I used the mega sheet to level up my skills. So you can use that the best way to do it. Uh, that's why I have 400,000 egg dose in my inventory. I have more than that now. I have over a million now because people donated. 11 kg. Yeah, on just corn, I did get a ghosty, but I'm getting a lot of very small fish. So I only have one with double corn. Is that a ghost or is my eye playing t tricks? That stupid son. It's playing tricks. 3kg. It's really fun to have pop-up method. I catch more rares on that. Well, we have two common goals. This 10 kg was on the 2D Fruity Soluble. Tiny one was on the 2D Fruity Soluble. Then Mirror Ghost was on uh, the double corn. So one rod is with just corn. Because it has better bite rate. If it gets really slow, then yeah, I will switch over to just corn. Pop-up method? Pop-up method is trash. Uh, and I have no points in pop-up method, so I don't want to use that. Like as soon as, like I when I unlocked pop-up method, I was using that because people were like, oh yeah, use that and you will, you know, level up, uh, have a better chance at leveling up your bottom fishing. Uh, but I never got any points on that. So I just don't use that anymore. Uh, pop up uh, using pop up method rig zero points, which is why I don't use it. Classic pop up of three of three points. Loop rig for me is the, the best rig if you want to level up your bottom fishing.
29 markers, 36 minutes. Mm. Eh. So 83 was dead, huh? For someone. I feel this bite rate is going to be where any, everywhere we go at Amber. It's 26 degrees. And then it cools down. Hola. Where am I supposed to troll at Ark? I'm not in your stream right now. Well, don't ask me if you're not in my stream. Uh, I didn't do the competition. I just did like 20 minutes of float fishing and then I just left. So unfortunately, I did not have a competition. Uh, but how do you do at tongue float fishing? What do you mean? You take a float setup and you go to Tunguska and you just cast it out and... Uh, if you have the right bait, you should get a bite soon. I'm not sure. <laughs> right at the dock, uh, there is an active spot with the uh, mayfly, I think. Uh, it's float fishing. I'm not going to make good money. That was just for a chance to get the trophy. You know, broad white fish, mucks and stuff like that bites on float there. So, but no trophy. Fish are absolute trash size right now. That is not good. I mean, if you are competent, uh, you can get one fish per minute there. Like one marker per minute there. Uh, I did it last weekend on stream as well. It's really good. Money-wise, I don't know. If you're good, maybe you'll make 300 to 400 silver per hour. Ooh. Yeah, I'm sure if you use two float rods, you can make really good money. But that's not what I'm about. It's just... Oh, ho, 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 yes! Tito Carp! Oh my god, the biggest rares have been on this middle rod. And the middle rod has the least bite rate. Oh my god, look at that. That has to be a double digit. Yes, 12.856. My eyes are just blown out right now by its coloration. <laughs> uh, very nice. Very nice. Tito. Look at how many ghost carps we have. Oh my god. It is a slow bite rate. We are getting a lot of small tiny fish, but and we're getting them ghosts. That is just a frame from us. Thank you, thank you guys, thank you. Uh, thank you very much. I just wanted double digit, uh, you know, rare carps and we've finally gotten one. The other one was very close, 9.89 kg. Pike a bit that Starbus carp and oh come on, that's a little too much. Thank you, thank you guys. We will now check our fish bag to see all the different uh, ghosties we have. Okay, so if we go by weight, look at this: twelve point eight kg red Starbus. Is it Starbus or Starva? I don't know. Common. 
common ghost card we have two we have two kg and 9.7 kg we have mirror ghost card 3.4 you know tiny worthless probably 12 kg red starvis Is that a ghost? No, stupid son. Blink tricks. Scaly? No, I don't want to just say something. I want to know how to properly pronounce it. And I prefer saying Starvis or Starvo or Scaly. I'll ask Babby. Babby knows how to pronounce these names. Uh, 42 minutes, 36 markers. Honestly, not a bad bite rate. Uh, it's just that very small fish. And we don't have any 20 or bigger fish either. Uh, but with these ghosties i'm happy even if we you know make only three four hundred silver in an hour i'm still happy because we got a few ghosties it's a japanese carp but the name isn't japanese it's red starvis carp it's it's in english Nihau carp. Nihau. I don't even know if that's Japanese actually. Amber Lake is in UK, really? That's an actual lake? I thought this was made up. The heck? Uh Amber Lake is located in the vicinity of the Baltic Sea coast. According to local lore lore. Uh, it got it got its name due to the glitter of numerous carp whose bright scales shine and radiate in the sun like bright amber. This lake is very popular today among carp fishing fans. I need to Google this. I thought this was made up. This is the stuff that kills it. Just look at this. What is this? What is this? Of course I can Google it. I have fingers. Come on. <laughs> I'm not asking for permission here. <laughs> yeah, Balkan area? I don't... I don't know. Amber Lake. Not Amber Heard. No. Amber Lake. Wait, what the hell? That was a movie in 2011. I... Uh, I'm not interested in that. Amber Lake Fishing. Uh, Amber Lake, Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife. That tells me that's America. Uh, Amber Lake is located 12 miles southwest of Cheney, Washington. Two pole fishing is allowed. Okay, selective gear rules. Interesting. Uh, Washington. Guys, this is in America. Damn. Maybe there are more Amber Lakes. Maybe there's one, like they said, in, uh, in the Baltic Sea Coast around there somewhere. Wherever the heck Baltic Sea Coast is. Yeah, Google is only giving me um, uh, that lake in America, all the results. So I'm going to have to search harder. Oh my God, what is with these carps? <laughs> Big, stop shouting. Uh, Amber Lake Fishing 
Balkan? No, Baltic. Baltic. Uh, no, Amber Lake. First, oh my god. How do I even search for it when I don't even know, like, where the hell it's located? Uh, Amber Heard. What? Amber hunting in the Baltic Sea? No! Amber Lake Fishing, uh, Asia. Or will that be Europe? Will that be Europe area? Russia? Uh, let's see here. Russian Fishing 4. It's just Russian Fishing 4 results. Why is this so hard? <laughs> uh, 35 meter clip here. They say all locations really exist in Russia. What is this trash fishing? Come on. Yeah, these tiny carps are really putting me off right now. <laughs> Uh, Amber Lake Fishing. Let's just put Amber Lake, Europe. Uh, Amber Lake, Wikipedia, there we go, okay. Uh, so there's an Amber Lake in Minnesota and an Amber Lake in Washington. Uh, there's North Am Amber Lake in Blaine County, Idaho, <laughs> South. Can you stop giving me Amber Lake in America, please? Are there no Amber Lakes anywhere else in the world? On Wikipedia for Amber Lake, it only states it's in US. Like, this shouldn't be hard. Uh, Borostonia Lake? Slova Slo Slovenian Hungarian. It was named after the ancient trade route, the Amber Route. No, that's not it. Driving in Russia, Amber Lake. Aha! Oh! Amber Lake is located in the valley of Yantarian, uh, which is situated near the city of that in that region after the Second World War abandoned pit began to fill with groundwater, which mixed with rainfall turned into a small lake. Ah, 1.5 kilometer by 700 meters. Ah, a large gulag was established in which 6,000 prisoners worked. What kind of history does this lake have? Uh, until the 50s, the 20th century, almost 250 tons of amber were mined. I don't know what the hell I'm looking at right now. You know what? I am just going to stop my search here. It says in Russia, okay. Ah, poop. Wrong rod. There we go. Finally, another one. Decent size, not a 3 kg garbage. That 
that is a frame leather carp that's a frame and a leather at the same time no it's just a frame carp So if I go to Amber, right, like this is all it, it says. Is there any way I can get more info on this? The vicinity of the Baltic Sea coast. I don't know where Baltic Sea coast is. But anywho, I am done with that. <laughs> searching for its whereabouts. Oh, man. Lithuania, Latvia, Estonia. Okay. That isn't Russia, then. And nowhere in-game does it say it's in Russia. It says by the Baltic Sea coastline or whatever. After this, we can try the 83 spot, if this starts to suck. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to search. I wanted to Google Red Starvis Carp, if that's a real thing. Like, is that a made up fish? Actually, let me see its description. Red Scary was bred in Hungary and is hybrid of the Hungarian scaly carp and koi. As a result of interbreeding, this carp is more slender than the other carps with the red colored scales. Images. Aha! Hungarian common carp strain. Interesting. Where we, where we, where we interesting? At night time, we will move to the 83 spot. Fifty four minutes, forty four markers. Yeah. <laughs> Do I have PBA on these guys? Yeah, kind of wasting my PBA here. garbage not even a marker tench no I'm not going arc it's bad weather so I decided to go to amber instead original plan was arc but it's like a thunderstorm every day it's windy every day so I'm just not gonna take the chance
What other combo can I use? Because I'm not liking these tiny carps. And the weeklies aren't going to help me. Very, very yellow. Spice mix pop up. I have. I think spice mix that people are using are soluble ones and not pop-ups. I'm not sure. I gotta look at the weekly again. Garbage. Cream. Which one? Just the cream. The, I just have the dip for that. That's it. Cream flavor white. Okay. I can turn this one into cream flavor white. Damn, that's a lot of corn on one rod. Titus, hey, how's it going? What's up? Like this, cream, corn, and then tutti frutti dip. Got a few minutes. Oh man, you got a pike trophy. Congratulations. Damn. Nice. I wish I could get a trophy Ladoga Atlantic or a Pike there. Okay, four corn setup. Okay, I got it. Man, I don't want to reel it back. We will, uh, we will put it on after we get cast this fish. What is this trash? Come on.
like I said, the night time when the buy rate dies, we're going to move to 83. Hopefully the bite rate there should be fresh and good. <laughs> uh, one hour, three minutes, 50 markers, uh, which is a good bite rate, but these tiny ones are just no bueno. Hopefully we made, you know, 400 silver. I hope it's looking maybe 350 silver, I feel like. Darden, hey, how's it going? Welcome. Twenty-one kg Atlantic salmon. Wow, that's some good stuff. Man, I didn't go arc even though I wanted to because uh, forecast was saying it's going to be windy and thunderstorm. So I'm definitely a have to go to arc tomorrow because I need money. Abraham, hi, I am doing good. How about yourself? Welcome to the stream. It's windy and higher waves. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> And tiny, tiny fish. Why? I feel like we should move. This spot's really bad.
you know a good spa the issue is even if it was good for you it doesn't mean it's going to be good for me uh people are catching trophies at 64 spot people caught trophies at the 83 spot so there are many good spots it's just what's working right now for me that's the issue five meter hole this one i'm not gonna go that far i'm just gonna check 83 and that's gonna be it Yeah, Tutti Frutti's working everywhere. Uh, it's been working for the past two, three weeks, I think, now. Wow, I placed them all without having an issue. Spot is in the middle of the two aisles. Right here. Or here. Oh, this one. Doesn't matter. It's too far. I don't want to go there. I'm just going to check out 83 and that's it. But thank you. Uh, let's see here. 56 markers in 60 minutes. Go. Let's see if we can get another ghosty. White bream, what the heck? Fishing is so bad that we're actually catching breams. Finally, a decent sized fish here.
Look at that, 14 kg short-headed barbel. Everyone is fishing for the short-headed barbel. I wish that was a ghost or a rare carp. Eleven kg mare, yuck. Short headed barbel. Look at this sixteen to eighteen kg. Three of them were today. Wow, crawfish pellet and crab and mussel fourteen soluble. <clears throat> you guys gotta tell me if anyone has caught a short-headed barbel trophy today you guys got to tell me what spot this is where it is pva everything because a lot of people are catching weeklies right now look at this look at this guys other region everything is today 11.9 to 14.8 kg short-headed barbel but wow mainly crawfish pellets and crab and muss Ah, uh, no PB on this guy. I need to put PB. <laughs> 73 gram black buffalo is a weekly record. That is sadness. Wow, in other regions, only one black buffalo has been caught. 657 gram, that is insane.
Uh, I'm gonna stay till maybe end of morning in game and that's gonna be it. I might end earlier if it's gonna be this trash. Ooh, look at this, Sebrolino, that's cool, Sebrolino with a lure, wow, carp hair rig, <gasps> what, I can do that kind of fishing, cool, slider flow, what the heck is this? Bait, bait, wait, double baits? Since when? Cool. Tomorrow is finally going to be normal weather. Maybe the carps will start biting again. Welcome back, Danny. I'm doing good. How about you? Amber's been really slow, but I'm hoping uh, now that the temperature's back to normal, maybe it'll pick up. We're just waiting for the carpos to wake up in another two minutes, I think. It's going to hopefully pick up. Uh, do we have... Yes, okay, perfect. Mm. 
I'm going for money. If a trophy comes, it comes. Uh, rares mostly is what I want. But at this point, anything. I need some money. I only have 1,200 silver. Three levels off, you'll get there soon. And then you need to level up your bottom fishing because bottom fishing makes a big difference. And then, <laughs> then you'll be fighting to level that up. Okay. Simp, hello, thank you so much for suggesting that. Honestly, what else can I try? Uh, but I am just waiting for morning for the bites to start. If in the morning we're still not getting bites, that means something is really wrong. Someone is at Amber. Oh, he's at Bear. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to wait. Spend another 10, 15 minutes. And that's going to be it. Amber was really hot the last hour plus we've been here. Hour and a half. But now it's finally back to normal. It's 17 degrees today Celsius. Uh, sure. You could send it on Discord. Wake up. Wake up, Amber. Welcome back.
Yeah, it's uh, it's not looking good. Did I get any more sturge? I don't know when you left. Uh, but the second hour was slow with the sturge. Oh, what is it with these trash carps? Ah. Guys, I'm going to spend another five minutes here. And then we will tally up how much money we made. All right, thank you so much, Danny. You too. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try not to. Oi! What the heck? What the heck? What is this? Is this a trophy carp or is this a troll carp? This is the Tagara, so it's most likely a troll. That's a troll. Had it ran for a while, it would have been a trophy. It is a common carp, though, by the looks of it. <laughs> Last minute. Let's keep you hooked. Okay, he's on land. Oh, man, that is not a trophy, is it? Damn. 17 kg. I wish. Well, there you go. <laughs> now you can rest easy. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, man. See you soon enough. Bye. Yeah, for quadruple corn, that's a good size. I just wish we would get a few ghosts now to make up for all the slow time. Seventeen, twelve, twelve, eleven, eleven, ten. Uh, one hour, thirty four minutes. All right, are we going to get anything on this? Uh, 35 meters. All right, let's check the cafe and then sell our fish and see how much we made in one hour, 35 minutes. Noise, 74 silver, 94 silver, 94 silver from that. Oh man, that's going to help us out a lot.
Oof. 700, 800 silver, guys, with the cafe order. 800 silver in 1 hour 37 minutes. What? How is that even possible? 800 silver in one and a half hours. Uh, 94 silver for the cafe order, so it's 800. 12.8 kg red starvis or starva carp scaly, 107 silver. Wow, I had no idea they were that expensive. Almost 10 kg common ghost carp, 68 silver. 17 kg 33, 20, 20, and then just sadness here. How did it even add up to 700? Like everything is worthless after, you know, two or three rows. Uh, Mare Ghost Carp, 10 silver, 2.2 kg common ghost, 8 silver. Wow, I'm surprised. And uh, you know what? I'll take it. I'm super happy <laughs> with that. I wow it was that is a surprise global weekly record short headed barbell 16 kg i'm telling you guys these short headed barbells someone found a spot and they're just coming in now thank you so much for subscribing user welcome to the family i hope you enjoy your stay here wow good fishing even though we were catching a lot of smaller carpos uh surprisingly good okay that is going to be it from me i hope you enjoyed the stream i hope you enjoyed hanging out with us here it's 157 Ooh. okay i'm gonna write this down short-headed 157 what's the clip because the calls uh crawfish pellets crab and mussel Crawfish, pellet, crab, and mussel. Crawfish, pellet, crab, and mussel. Clearly, that's the combo working. What's going to be the clip there? I don't know. I hope by tomorrow someone posts on Discord. Like the line leader and stuff and all that stuff. All right. Thank you so much, guys, for hanging out with me, for helping me out, for everything. <laughs> I will see you tomorrow. I'll be streaming tomorrow, same time, R4. And let's see where I go next. Uh, until tomorrow, I ho hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I hope you have a great rest and a great start off your Sunday. Bye, guys. Bye, Big, uh, Zimp, Romario, Danny. Goodbye, guys. Hopefully see you tomorrow.